Hi guys. Hi guys. Hello everyone. Um, it's very hot in Bombay. Hi everyone. How are you all? I am Vita Sabat and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm gonna film a Sheen haul and there is a little backstory for this video. Just listen to me. So this video is like the longest video ever. It's like my longest video that I've taken to shoot. Longest time that I've taken to shoot a video. I specifically ordered all these clothes for this haul, this video in October end. These clothes are like winter outfits and cute things. In October, I bought these clothes, okay, and then I just totally forgot about it. And the package came very late during November, and due to some reasons, I couldn't film the video then. So this video got postponed to December, and I filmed half of it in December around Christmas. But I had so many videos lined up, so I did not post it then also. And I forgot to shoot the intro thing, and I just shot the shots of me. Trying on clothes and dancing and all of that shit. My hair is different in that video and it's different here, so <laughs> there is no way I can cheat you guys. And now it's February and now I am posting this and most of the outfits are from winter and winter has almost ended and it's utterly useless. So okay. <laughs> You know, I for filming a video, I have to do so much of stuff. You know, I have to arrange things and send people out of my house, and so much. Before this video starts, I am giving like a big, 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 big thank you to my parents, mom, dad, and my brother for giving this space to me right now, for moving out for a while, for me to shoot this video properly. I love you guys. Thank you so much for all your support, always. So let's not delay anymore. We we'll start with our video now, and my battery will also die. So I have to film this very quickly. Also, the one thing that I needed the most was the basics of any outfit. Like you need to have these basics in your outfit, so that in your in your wardrobe, so that you can create new outfits from that every now and then. So my first outfit is this shirt. It's a plain white shirt. You can wear it with like a skirt and just tie the knots, and then it becomes like a cool new chic, 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 chic blouse. My favorite thing to do with a plain white shirt is to wear it with a sweater outside, and you know the collar is out and the wrists. Shut up. And the wrists are out, and the collar is out, and uh, it just gives you the old school going vibe. I had the similar uniform in my school. I just love it. People who have you know winter uniform in their school, they know what I'm talking about. Now this is the most Instagram friendly look. It's the best. It's just nothing but baggy pants and the white shirt. It just looks so effortlessly stylish. You can pair it with like sneakers or just pair of small heels, and you are good to go, man. <laughs> The next thing I bought is a plain white T-shirt, uh, like this. But this is attached with this dress thing. <laughs> I can't find uh, the actual T-shirt I bought because I don't know. It's somewhere in the wardrobe. It's all messed up in there. I personally think that white T-shirts are a blessing, and you should definitely have those in your wardrobe. They even look so nice and fine without, you know, styling. You can style them with like a checked skirt like this for that ultimate, you know, cute girl anime K-drama look or whatever. 
my favorite thing to do is to layer them with a camisole top it like this it is like so cute if you're not into the scandalous and raunchy looks or whatever uh, or if you're not comfortable wearing these like me because personally i have like flabby arm situation that's why i don't wear camisoles but yeah if you are like that you can wear a t-shirt underneath you can also pair it with a denim jacket and this the jacket is also from sheen but i have bought this like years ago so i don't remember uh, when i bought it and why I, i don't know but this is the best thing ever i love the jacket and the white plain t-shirt combo it's so stylish <sighs> <coughs> oh my god so much of white going on right so another white uh, thing that i bought is this white high neck top this is actually a, like a, a polyester thing it has like long arms and it has this detailing on the arms and the neck I ordered this in size L because I thought it will be very tight for me and now the arms are really weird from uh, the armpit also I bought this thing twice I don't know why and now I can't even return it because I bought it like 4 months ago so um, you want it take it I got this neon green colored uh, sweater i just wanted to buy it because it reminds me of fujin jay from legend of the blue sea and like it was the cutest scene ever and he was wearing this exact same colored sweater don't ever buy things on that impulse because i don't know when i will be able to wear this again maybe next winter or it may be somewhere on a holiday or something and i realized that i'm wearing this sweater inside out the whole time house stupid then i paired this uh, t-shirt thing with a skirt a vintage skirt it's kind of like one of my favorite looks from the whole thing it's like a rachel green inspired outfit she wore the similar or almost same thing in an episode of friends and i loved it she was looking so pretty and thin and everything and i looked like a truck but i think that's okay i it's still kind of cute it's kind of like a woolen fabric and it has this button detailing over here which is very vintage one more thing you can do with this skirt is that you can pair it with any color that is present on the skirt you can pair it with like this creamish color or red black green everything will look good on this because it has all the color prints over here so Most of you might not be knowing but I am in love with graphic t-shirts. I love yellow but this is not yellow. This is kind of mustard colored t-shirt. I've got it in small but this is a medium t-shirt. It still looks kind of good. I don't know. I bought a size larger than myself because I was very conscious of looking fat in this video but now I go to the gym. <laughs> It's actually a Michael Angelo painting. You can pair this t-shirt with like a jean you can also pair this with a uh, black colored shorts oh i found this t-shirt now this is the plain t-shirt i was talking about earlier moving on to this sun dress i love this color it's kind of brownish reddish brick color it looks like i'm in the summer of 16 i paired this with this white blouse it's like i'm kind of into modest fashion right now it really gives that you know korean soft girl vibes you know and you have sale okay so this is a huge turtleneck sweater which is s sized i did not understand the sheen size chart this time i don't know why large size things are too large small size things are also large and what should i buy the extra small and if i buy extra small it will come like extra small but anyway this is a small size t-shirt which has the mighty arms but it really looks like a great ootd i also wore this in kutch as i told you that white and denim can never go out of style so i paired this with that huge denim jacket with my sleeves outside and it literally you know, and it really looks so amazing
next stupid thing that is on this list is this uh, overcoat because you know I can never wear this in Bombay. I actually love overcoats but I'll still keep it because it will be handy because I'm gonna go places. Also one more reason that I never bought them is that they are hella expensive in Zara and H&M. So I bought this from Sheen and it's pretty warm. For that price it's a good deal. I should have worn it with a thinner sweater but anyway in this outfit I look like a French girl like bonjour bonsoir oh look I'm a princess so this cute peach dress is so nice but the sizing charts on Sheen were on some drugs that day this is a small sized frog but it is so loose I just don't get it why these were like so weird sized I don't want to give this dress up though it is very cute I will get it fixed I hope it has like a mesh layering and flower looking pieces and it's so modest because on Sheen it says that it is half sleeves but it, is, it comes with sleeves I know I'm saying this a lot but I've bought like so many stupid things so I again fell for this uh, vintage looking dress it is pretty but it would look great on a taller person I think it has those flappy butterfly arms and high neck printed with old flower print and you know dimple kapadia vibes it has elastic waist and like flary bottoms I am not sure what to do with this dress I think I'll wear it for a photo shoot or something. So I got this woolen dress also which is also checked. I again pulled the modesty card and wore that white sweater thing underneath. Kinda hard to pull that chain though. It is somewhat wool and a basic check pattern which is very chic and classy. Okay, so, <laughs> oh my god, this brown overcoat, <laughs> now this trench coat or whatever, it's not the best, but it kind of looks cool. Uh, it looks larger than my size, you know, I'm not even surprised anymore. And the collar is just a cutout and there are no buttons or anything. So it's like, uh, if you want to layer a lot of stuff, you can wear this. I think it's okay for like a photo shoot or something or like if you're feeling like extra cold and you have space to wear something else, so you can wear it. Okay guys, hear me out. This is definitely, definitely my worst buy. I hate this dress. I thought it will look really cool, look really classy with the bow and diamond thing going on and it will make me look like an English snack. But uh, I look like a loaf of bread in it now somehow and it has no fit whatsoever. It is also small sized. Sheen, I am so angry. I will convert this into like a crop top and a skirt. I'll have to do something with it. Uh, but till then it will remain in my wardrobe. Then I bought this pair of palazzos. I again bought a bigger size. I bought this in medium. I should have gotten it in small because I have this food baby action going on on my tummy. So I didn't want to look weird. It's a great pair of pants actually. It has like flary bottoms which will look really great with some high heels or even some sneakers. Now I bought some extra stuff uh, from Sheen. I bought some pair of tights. Like I bought three of them. I just wanted two but again one extra I don't know why they look really cool with skirts and you know dresses if you don't want to show off your legs they really make your legs look thin I bought these hairbands which came in a pack of three I'm not really like a headgear person I don't wear headbands and pins but I think I should because they really make you look cute I bought these pair of sandals I bought these nude sandals. They are really pretty but they are large of course. I got it in my size only but they are large. I will sue. <laughs> I 
I can wear this with jeans and dresses and whatnot. They are really cute, but a uh, little large. Another pair I got are these maroon heels, which I think are really cute, but beware of the sizing thing. Again, they are kind of my size, but not so much. I also got this bathrobe thing, but I'm not uh, in a mood to open it and show you guys. I will show you a picture. Yeah, this is a complete waste of my money. <laughs> okay, I also bought belts, a black and a tan colored belt, which I have not used yet because uh, I need more holes in this and I'm too lazy to do that. So I'm using my old belts only, but this has a nice round buckle, which is very popular uh, nowadays, I guess. <sighs> Guys, I'm not so much into fashion and stuff and this is regular stuff that I wear. I might be wrong in some things and telling you some things uh, and uh, I just want to tell you that you wear whatever is comfortable. I wear things that I am comfortable in. Early I used to wear uh, things to just to impress people and wear like things I'm not comfortable with, some tight clothing or whatever I felt was pretty but not on me but I would still wear it just to look good but instead I ended up looking horrible uh, because I was not comfortable in it. My style is to be comfortable. Uh, yes, I've told this like 20 times under law anyway but this is a lesson for you guys that wear whatever you want to wear i'll put the outfit links in the description whatever i can find so you can uh, get it for yourself if it's still available beware of the sizes and yeah if you like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel i post videos every week i hope i have not missed anything because i'll kill myself i really love you all for 20k subscribers without any kind of help or anything i am so grateful for this 20,000 people have subscribed to my channel it's like a big thing for me maybe not a big thing for others but it's a really huge thing for me thank you so much and do comment below what was your favorite outfit anyway i am done so uh, i'm gonna see you next week bye 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 bye